20 minutes now past 5 a.m. here on the sixth day of December, taking a beautiful look over the Detroit River here as you're rolling out of bed or starting your day or getting your exercise on. I have to say, I, I had a moment this morning. I mean, we, we saw the emails that our staff, our fellow coworkers sent us about how icy it was. But when I walked down my porch to go to my car, I put my hand on the banister and I was like, whoop. Mm -hmm. I mean, it was literally covered yep. in ice. Yep. Is it still icy out there? I think so. For a lot of the houses, yeah. your, oh man, your backyard, your driveway, mm. the stairs. We don't want any viral right. videos. No. Uh, we've seen them before and that could happen. We picked up a lot of moisture just yesterday and the temperatures have fallen well into the 20s in most spots. So just be aware of patchy ice, not only on the roads, but also around the house. Sunrise will be at 747 this morning, sunset at 501 p.m. Once the sunshine gets going, we should start to raise these temperatures away from the freezing mark, and that's going to help us out. But until that happens, just be aware of this. Now, that's the primary concern this morning, especially around the house. We also have a slight chance of seeing some rain and some snow passing through. It may start off as snow and then mixing with rain later this afternoon until finally the chance will diminish. You'll actually see some of that on radar just northwest of Flint. We're at 27 across many locations. You can actually see some breaks in the clouds too, so it will be a brighter day compared to yesterday, but still a cold one. The numbers just aren't going to move that much. 20s to start finishing with the upper 30s and once again that snow is headed in our direction. It's not going to be a ton of it, but enough to get your attention to say the least. So 27 Apache ice for the bus stop forecast. So the kids, of course, they'll have to be careful as well. 39, so a winter fill for today, not even reaching the 40s, which is our average high for this time of year. That'll be the case for much of the area, and then we'll see some changes. In fact, for tonight, we'll still have the clouds, and then we'll see numbers trying to return back to the 30s, and the warm up begins for Thursday. Temperatures will punch into the upper 40s for tomorrow. I'll call it a short lived warm up because we'll see some big changes into the weekend but not until after the warm up that is. So 47 for Thursday, 50s for Friday and Saturday. The big change up on Sunday leaves us with the 30s to start next week.